Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So this time around I decided I would try something a little bit different with you guys. And for this month's new Fabletic stuff, I wanted to actually show you how you could wear some of it in action. So this is the Cashel Midi Sports Bra. It's got removable cups as usual. I got mine in an XXL and which is basically like a size 16, 18. It's this cute little powder blue color. It goes to about just a, uh, I mean, just down to my waist pretty much. And then for my pants, I have the Power Hold 7 8 leggings on. And these also have like a mesh detail. They match the top perfectly. And they are just a tiny bit cropped, but I'm a tiny bit short. So sometimes they go all the way down to the ankle. They are really, really, really comfortable and they have a very high rise on them. They have a lot of stretch. And an outfit like this, which like this bra doesn't have a whole ton of support. This is something that I would typically wear if I was going to be doing some kind of yoga or just generally stretching. Just doing anything that's not like super duper 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 high impact. And in case you guys didn't know, I am a Fabletics ambassador. So this video is in partnership with them. And just like every other month, you guys can go to fabletics.com slash Sarah Ray Vargas and you can sign up to become a VIP member and you actually get two pairs of leggings for $24 when you sign up to become a member. You never, ever, ever have to pay to be a member unless you choose to do so. You can always, between the first and the fifth of every single month, go online and choose to skip the month. You do not have to buy the credit, but if you choose to get a credit, then you can use your $49.95 that it costs to go ahead and get an outfit or shop at your convenience. You don't have to do it that day. The credits never, ever, ever expire and you get lots of benefits from becoming a VIP member, like different discounts. You get daily discounts. You get access to exclusive stuff, which if you follow me on Instagram, you know about that. And you can also um, just be the first in the know to get new outfits every single month. So let's get started. Like I said, I like to stretch either before or after I work out. Clearly, this is not gonna be like a real deal workout because I'm full face, full hair, everything. Um, but I'm gonna give you an idea of what I would typically use it for. That you're up to no good. Everyone has been telling me that you got me hooked. You're playing it big time. You're feeding me lies. Everyone has been bugging me to sever the ties. But I would never, ever, ever would have believed them. No reason. Sometimes the truth is hard to see But now the never, ever, ever seem to be over I saw her. So I'm happy I got freed Lucky, lucky, lucky me uh -oh -oh. Lucky, lucky, lucky me For this particular outfit, actually, I really love this top. It is, let me not butcher it, it's called the Giselle Power Touch Built-In Bra Swing Tank. So it is actually two pieces, but they're connected to become just one piece. The bra itself, again, removable cups, always stretch, you know the deal. The leggings too have always stretch and everything. Um, but it's so nice that they're connected because me personally, I usually wear a tank top or a sweater or something over my bra. So I love these because it's just like a one and done. And the back is really cute too. It has some nice little details back there. So the top, I got mine in an XXL. And I don't believe that these come in plus sizes, but the XXL is basically up to a size 18. Super duper comfortable, love it, always happy with it. And then these leggings are a little bit different. Um, I feel like I get more movement out of them. These are the high-waisted statement power form leggings. These ones have like a lot of movement, all right? I mean, I don't have enough movement to support these leggings, okay? They have a lot of movement. They also have the pockets on the side, which is really nice when it's shady and then it's sunny and then it's shady and then you don't know if you need your sunglasses and you also need to carry, let's say, your gym card or your headphones or your keys or whatever. There are pockets on the side. These are also moisture wicking as usual. Like I said, they have the always stretch and they are chafe free. So chafe free zone here. Um, this kind of outfit I would wear 
to work out and do pretty much anything. I don't feel limited in any way by this. And like I said, I have like the nice little added coverage and stuff in the front. So I'm super comfortable doing pretty much anything in this particular I'm style. To smile, but I would never, ever, ever would have believed them. No reason. Sometimes the truth is hard to see. But never, never, ever, ever seem to be over. I saw her. So I'm happy I got freed. Lucky, lucky, lucky me. Uh oh. Lucky, lucky. All right, guys. Half for number three. I just climbed a hill. I'm actually. I was supposed to be fake working out. It didn't work out that way. It's actually like 90 some degrees. And this is officially a real workout. These pantaloons here. These are the power hold. Hang on, I don't want to mess it up. I messed it up. These are the Mila pocket capris. I'm not real, real tall, so they don't go super, super short on me. Um, they're really comfortable though. They kind of remind me of the power hold ones and the way that they fit, like the feel of them. Um, they're not quite as like lightweight as the ones that I just showed you. But these ones also have some nice pockets here on the side, the mesh pockets to hold all of your stuff, whatever you want to stick in there. And they have the cool mesh like detailing down the side here. So they're pretty opaque as well. They're a nice high rise, which you'll see as I'm running along. And then this tank top is the Trisha mesh tank. And I have this in um, a 1X for the pants. I have the top and the bra in an XXL. And I have the tank in a 1X. So it's just like a really nice big kind of oversized tank. It's kind of got that muscle tank look, which you guys know, I'm not a fan of looking super masculine and I'm feeling kind of like a bro right now, which is not my favorite thing, but it is comfortable and it's really breathable, lightweight, stretchy. It's got everything it needs to have basically. And then the bra underneath, this is um, an XXL, the size of it. And this is the Tamara Low Impact Sports Bra. So this is one that I would wear well, pretty much whenever, because I feel like their low impact stuff is actually still pretty good as far as, um, you know, being able to do whatever workouts you want. However, if you're a little bustier, I'd probably go with a medium to high impact if you're going to be jogging up hills or even walking steadily up them. I'd probably go with something a little bit higher impact, but the Tamra Bra is actually really, really comfortable, so I'm a fan of using it for it pretty much anything. I think I've had a few of them now. And it's got cool detail because it has like the little, it has cutouts and stuff as you go along. So it's pretty nice. It's a pretty nice little bra. This is my next outfit. Are you ready to see me jogging around? I should have brought the drone. We missed the boat on that one, but just envision aerial shots. Maybe Google aerial jogging shots and insert them into your brain. Pause the video, go do that, and then come back. show you and I'm gonna do a little bit of jump roping in it um, I have a great bra this is my favorite bra I don't even need the tag this is the all day every day slap your mama it's so good bra I love it look at it from the back from the front all of it it's a thousand degrees but I couldn't help but show you guys this dumb cute sweater it says never settle or from up here it kind of looks like it says sweet Seattle so you know read it however you want it's really cute it's cropped it is the Stacy pullover it's a like little Terry fabric. It's just, it's a really cute, simple little bra. And then these shorts, if my cameraman could dip, dip it low, bring it up slow. No, if I dip, you dip, we dip. Okay. So you dip, because I'm going to dip. Okay, well, let's both dip. Ready? Okay, let's both dip. Go. All right. So we're dipping. These are the high-waisted solid ultra cool shorts. They're like a, like a light compressive kind of fabric. These definitely give you full range of motion. They're chafe free, always stretch all just protection everywhere. I do love the ones that have the um, pockets on the side too. I think those are the Trinity shorts. Those are some of my fave too. These ones I like because they're so lightweight and 
Like, I just feel like I can move any direction in these and I'm gonna be good to go. They look good from the back, cameraman. Thank you very much. They look good all the way around. Um, and like I said, I'm gonna show you guys me jumping around a little bit, but I do wanna take a second just to say that I know some of you guys have some serious like gym intimidation going on. And I know that a lot of us maybe aren't super comfortable going to the gym and working out outdoors is always a great option if you are trying to get a little bit more active of course you can always do stuff in your house too i've showed you guys on my vlogs before me working out at the house on the treadmill doing jumping jacks in the garage doing some weight training in the living room and having my kids interrupt me every six seconds like i just feel good so long as i get a workout in regardless of how i get that workout in so if you don't want to be in the gym and have everybody judging you go to the park maybe one that doesn't have eight thousand people People. not sure if you guys could actually see that but there are actually quite a few people at this one but just go out whenever you feel comfortable when I first started working out way 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 long ago yes I have to work out to maintain this body okay so thank you very much um, but when I first started working out I actually would just go run around the block but I would just do it kind of at night when I felt like there were less people out but you know as ladies you gotta be careful so take your jump rope and get ready to choke somebody out if needed now let's go jump some rope all right okay and don't forget that if you guys want to sign up for fabletics and give them a shot you can get two pairs of leggings for 24 dollars when you go to fabletics.com slash sarah ray vargas or just hit the link that is down in the description box become a vip member get lots of discounts be the first in the know and get to buy some super cute outfits every month all right now let's go so i found that while jumping rope I can't do the traditional just up and down thing. I have to do this little Charlie Brown. Duh, 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 duh. This is the only way that I Watch can Watch out for that snake, too. This is the only way that I found that I can properly jump rope, okay? Um, however, it's hard to do it on camera and look good, so I'm gonna stop where I'm at. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you prefer kind of this type. Who knows what this is gonna look like? I had two cameramen here and like four cameras. So, hope it came out good. Hope you guys enjoyed it. <laughs> and if you have any questions, go ahead and leave them down below. I gotta pee. Anybody else gotta pee every time they jump rope? Just me, have some kids, and then talk to me. Uh -oh. lucky, lucky.